Multiple bars across the metro under investigation tonight after a woman died in a head-on crash with the MEMS ambulance Sunday morning. KRK4's Mitch McCoy working for you tonight. He's in studio with records that show a Little Rock police officer talked with the woman 30 minutes before the accident. Is that right? Yeah, that's absolutely right. Bob and Ashley, good evening to you both. KRK receiving the internal memo just this afternoon. It shows a 21-year-old woman left a downtown Little Rock bar after talking with a police officer and bar staff just before 5 a.m. Tonight, ABC confirms to me that multiple bars could be fined, but at this point, couldn't say why. The night ended tragically for 21-year-old Brianna Carter here on Interstate 40 in Maumel, hitting a MEMS ambulance head-on early Sunday morning. Alcoholic beverage control officials confirmed Carter visited multiple establishments in the night, but ended up at Midtown Billiards on Main Street in Little Rock at 1.18 a.m. The memo alleges Carter had approximately three to four beers and one shot of whiskey at Midtown and paid with cash for each purchase, and the shot of whiskey was purchased by a friend. ABC agents say they watched the bar surveillance footage. It shows Carter remained in the pool table area throughout the night. Investigators say she left Midtown three hours later around 4.50 a.m. Investigators say it appears Carter sways once, but is able to exit alone and speaks with Midtown staff and an LRPD officer before leaving, getting in her car and driving away. About 27 minutes later, Arkansas State Police say Carter somehow started driving into oncoming traffic on the interstate, crashing into an ambulance head-on. Carter died at the scene. The two medics suffered non-life-threatening injuries. It's important to note the ambulance was not transporting a patient at the time. I reached out to Little Rock Police earlier today. At first, they were unaware an officer may have been talking with Carter before the crash. Since our original conversation today, LRPD has launched an internal investigation into the circumstances. Arkansas State Police waiting on toxicology results before the crash investigation can be closed. I reached out to officials at Midtown Billiards today. They had no comment. It's unclear tonight what the other establishments are. Ashley. Mitch, thanks very much. And here at KRK4 News, we're always working for you, and it's our job to give you a voice. If you see a story that you think maybe needs some extra attention, just let us know. You can give us a call or send us an email through our Working For You tip line.